Yeah, it's a very soundly designed game overall, I'd say. Yeah. And we're we're seeing that in the results. Again, even though we only had Smash 4 to inform the seeding at this tournament, minus what, like five big ultimate tournaments coming into this? I mean, we had glitch six, we had let's make moves, we had don't park on the grass, but so many of those results potentially, you know, with different rule sets and stuff, people were testing, you know? But at the same time, players that got that W, that gold, like Gluttony, for example, Valhalla 2, like, that's valid, you know, and it shows in the seating. But right away, PS2, Rose and Slug, Love seeing that we have a Falcon now because this character hasn't really seen too much play. If I'm thinking of the same dude, Slug is a Cloud slash Falcon from SoCal in Smash 4. Okay. So looks like he's opting for Douglas this time around. Bowser's movement looks so fun now. I mean, he was fast in Smash 4. Now it's like really tight and also just threatening. Yeah, everyone's fast now. So everyone's here and fast. <laughs> they're here. They're fast. And uh, that's pretty much all I got. Yeah, so this match has the potential to be so dynamic with both of these characters just hitting with their all. I want to see a knee. I want to see a spike. I want to see everything that both of these characters have to offer, and the players, because it's really difficult because both of them have telegraph recoveries. And how Slug is changing it up as Bowser is what's going to determine the whole set. Yeah, in the case of Bowser, he's got all that raw kill power. Falcon has that, plus the ability to string so many hits together, plus Extremely ridiculous movement. In this game, it's a bit toned down. Of course, his dash grab doesn't slide him halfway across the world, but he's gotten some other changes to benefit him, like that up B being a lot stronger, too. Armor, wow. armor on side B as well. And a yeah, forward yeah, throw, true. how hilariously unconventional. Of course, 186 after a hit, and then firing back with a fair, dying after hit 141. I mean, they're really laying it into each other. Also, I just definitely noticed that uh, Slug is on the Bowser side of things, so maybe I'm thinking of a different dude. Um, but yeah, okay, it's Rose playing Captain Falcon. <laughs> Sorry guys, I uh, cannot read sometimes. Yeah, reading, reading is tough. Although fundamental is tough. But, you know, it's mostly even. He is a 99, but let's be real, you know? His 99 is Falcon's, like, 70. For sure. If not less, we saw him live up back here across stage at 176 after the hit, man. That's pretty ridiculous. Yeah, and the confidence you have to play with when you're playing a big body and he caught the Falcon kick with forward smash? He was looking for that before, too. Uh, trapped a landing he just missed. Such a committal move. Yeah, it really is. But hey, man, with a little bit of armor on it, that significantly improves the utility. You just crush through any quick ground moves usually. Yeah, down tilt. This is such an interesting tit for tat matchup because they're just like hitting each other a little bit more and then punishing each other largely in the same way. Failed landings, hard committal moves, and you don't really expect that so much from Falcon because he's the quicker character, but landing with that Falcon kick definitely got him punished, you know? Down throw up air, no but need. nothing no after, need. yeah. Of course, at 100%, you're gonna be hard pressed to turn that up air into any true combos. Yeah, the previous hit stun, of course, being toned down so much doesn't allow for those true combos anymore. Yeah, you basically have to fall back on the first hit of neutral air into the ground as Falcon to get combos now. Yeah, neutral air is just so good now at being able to catch people who don't expect it the second hit killing. That high arc on Bowser's forward air, gonna swat him away. Oh, that could have been the game, of course. Not a risk worth taking, and that, he was wide open for that one, but of course there's so much drift that Falcon has after his up B. Oh. You can never be too sure. Fire you don't breath not being able to move. do anything. Oh, and the dunks. All right, it's gonna be the first game for Rose, our Captain Falcon player here. That's hype. That's a, that, the hype zoom in only because like, oh, it's just like what you wish you could always see in Melee or something, where they're always hitting those. My only, Stomp. only problem with it is when it's a lie. You know what I'm you saying? You think so? Yeah. So that was my concern prior to the game's release, only because I thought it would kill the tempo too much. But actually, it adds so much to the intensity of the match. Like, it he's does. Dead. That he's is, that it he's does. dead. He's not dead. And like all of that wrapped into the fact that it's usually off stage, usually like down there deep. Like I, I think it's hype. The only, I, um, only real issue is that it can mess your tech timing up when you could like tech a spike kind into the of wall. like getting a little mac ko punch or limit cross slash but yeah, it's something yeah. you get used to you know and, yeah of course and i think that like like so much like we are when we're looking back at the other game and it looks completely foreign we're now getting used to the little things now and it's yep. showing definitely saw a smash 4 match the other day and had no idea what i was watching so uh, we're, we're in that period where now this is becoming natural and we're all used to it. It's just about two months after release. Yeah, and again, you know, I want to stress, like, both of them are landing with a lot of aerials, but we're not seeing the pairing. The pairing is still something that's probably, it, like, you have to learn it and you have to apply it. But again, if you don't take those chances and you're not ready to do it in tournament, you're just not going to. So, 
course. Yeah. Sorry, go on. Yeah, you have to play very bravely in the, the early stages of the game to take those new things, such as parrying, like you said, and actually work them into your gameplay when it counts. Yeah, and parrying is so committal. Even though it's just dropping shield, the problem is, is that if you don't time it well, you are dropping shield into a smash attack, into a fair from Cloud. Right. But, you know, again, it'll change as time goes on, and we're not seeing either player really miss out too much on it, but, you know, it probably will be what determines many games in the future. And probably at this tournament, because I'm telling you, some players have probably been practicing it, labbing it, applying it. How can I maximize this damage? How can I maximize oh! this? Rose, though, with the combos first and ready hit and to go. Yep, first that's, hit and air to knee, man. That's the new up air to knee. And our local boy, Nick C, of course, I'm talking about no trouble integrating that, being oh, that he yeah. was already going for it all the time in Smash 4, but now he just has new properties. It's going to send you up and out. Try to stay Falcon, of course. His boy here. Rose getting the combos. Almost wishful thinking with that knee after a down air. Another down air into knee coming back. Rose has him off stage, but Slug is able to recover, takes him with a forward air, and then a get-up attack sends it back off stage. Trying to reset to neutral here. Oh, that high arc forward air, though. Just enough to snatch Rose out of the air. He's running away with this game, though. This is potentially really dangerous. Falcon kick, just not enough. Bowser feels so much heavier in this game than he ever has. Yeah, the heavies feel heavies, and, you know, it's just very much like, again, you have to respect it, you have to watch out for it, you can't afford to be hit, just oh. like that. So this is not beyond question. 156, I mean... He's got ooh. max rage. He does. He, he does, he definitely does, but, you know, playing his cards right, unfortunately, not going to be the case this time. Rose plainly cleans that out with a forward spin. Falcon with that new and 